Hi everybody, welcome back to Rich Reviews. I'm Richard and today, welcome to Happy the Machine. Today we're back at Cafe in the Machine to meet with none other than Tom from TGE TV and my son Jacob is actually going to have an interview with Tom and also to meet with James from JM on Cars. Stop the video. Okay, so a brief interlude to the video just to introduce you to my son Jacob. The reason why Jacob's laughing is because we've got the cats next to the camera and the cats have decided to jump all I over see. each other just as we're doing the filming. Hi everyone, I'm Jacob and I'm the photographer, videographer and editor for the channel and I also do all the social media for the channel. The reason why Jacob's performing the interview with Tom is because uh, Jacob has uh, has an online relationship with Tom, they've communicated through, through messaging on Instagram etc and so we felt that it was the best place that actually Jacob performs the interview with Tom. He also has that, that young aspect, brings obviously that youth aspect to the channel as well, which is, which is what you need with those sort of interviews as well. I mean, I'm an old, old fuddy-duddy, so you know, who wants to see me performing an inter interview with a young, hip, happy-going guy like Tom? You know, Obviously, Tom is going to interrelate with a younger guy like Jacob a lot more. So, uh, and also, it's, it's a good way to, to get Jacob finally introduced to the channel in some way, shape or form. I'm sure you'll see Jacob at some point in the future in some of the videos. So, thanks guys. A short interlude and back to the main event. So the reason that Tom and James are here today is for Tom to actually hand over the 944 Turbo S that James has actually won through the actual Classic Cars raffle. We're in the background really. We don't want to encroach on their time during the actual handover. Tom TG, how are you doing? Hello mate, what's going on? Alright? They're yeah, very good, thanks. How's, uh, how's the house in the Cotswolds? Uh, it's still actually a bit of a mess to be honest really? with you. Yeah, it's borderline derelict, but <laughs> less on that the better. <laughs> um, so we've literally got five, about five or six questions for Tom um, that I just wanted to ask you. So, yeah, my dad and I run, the, run a YouTube channel of our own. We're about 400 subscribers, basically. It's 400 um, people, if, you, if I sat you down in front of 400 people and said, yeah. right, speak, you'd... it's a lot of people. That's true. It's based on our 458 Spider. I've actually DM'd you a few times. Is it the black one? No, it's not. It's a red. It's a red 458 Spider. Um, I can show you. This you can't bit. miss it. The number plate. It's, it's got the plate Rich B. The plate. Perfect. <laughs> 458 Spiders. They're great cars. Yeah. Silver wheels. Good yeah, old boy. Yeah. That. Yeah, we like that. Very five, nice. Five point one thousand miles when we got it last really? year. Really? So, yeah. They're great. It's hard to find a clean one of those. What advice would you give to someone looking to start a channel or somewhere you know, just someone that's around our sort of mark? that wants to sort of grow it to where you are now? I mean, if I knew all the answers, I wouldn't be stuck on 200,000 200, subs yeah. or whatever it is. Um, I guess just keep putting content out, stick to what you enjoy, because that will come across. Uh, be honest with your audience. Don't kind of don't kind of uh, BS them. I was going to swear there, but it's a family channel, I'm sure. Oh, I could do that. Um, yeah, just, just be legit, basically, and be honest, and just kind of put out stuff you want. And just remember that most videos are just titles and thumbnails. Yeah, so was, um, so what actually made you want to start the channel? Was it business, enjoyment? I wanted to, so I never actually needed to do YouTube early on. I actually did it because uh, I wanted to turn messing around with cars into a job. Right, so more of a business like, sort of thing. Yeah, yeah, like I wanted to make well, money, so. but I wanted my expensive hobby to be supported by yeah. the prattling around. Do you know yeah. what I mean? I wanted <laughs> the prattling around to actually really com stuff. compensate yeah, yeah. for, you know, just making kind of a, a cyclical thing. And now it's at the point right. where the more I practice around, the more stuff I buy, the more stuff I can buy. Yeah. Because it just generates more money. Yeah. So it's a nice kind of, it's a nice slip. Works well for you, but maybe not so much for other people. No, but you got to start somewhere and, you know, find your yeah. niche and then just, just hammer it. You know, if I'd sussed it, I wouldn't be making average videos for a living. You know, I'd be on a beach somewhere without social media. So, you know, I, I'm trying like everyone else, just slightly kind of maybe further along the road. 
Yeah. Uh, a lot of fly down the road to some others. That's so. the thing, it's all hustling, in it? You've got to hustle. Well, I mean, you've got 10 you've got supercars, so I mean, it's not that bad. Is all it? on tick. Actually, no, I own one of them. I own one of them, the rest are on tick, so um, yeah, good. <coughs> um, Debt. Yeah, another thing, you said in the recent video you were after a speciality. Any news on that? Are you actually looking for one? Not actively, no. I just, yeah, I'm kind of off the whole kind of car searching thing for the time being. Let me draw breath after the, uh, <laughs> what was the last one? Test Trosset. I got 992 yeah. Turbo X coming, which will scratch the edge for a bit. So before we had the 458 Spider, we had a 993 Car S, which we actually sold to get into that. Um, nice. And that was pretty much ideal spec. It was black on black with um, DBS wheels, and we pretty much did it up like, um, Perfect. like a proper 993. Perfect. Um, uh, would you say your, your channel is moving more towards that sort of uh, classic car space? Because I know you said you want a 993 as well, so is that on the list? Yeah, as well? 993 is on the list along with a load of other things. Um, I will move more towards the classic. I don't think it'll ever become like a full classic car channel because I think that is a bit dead. Um, you know, it's I just. to be the full audience. Yeah, so, I think yeah. me doing the classic stuff, I, it's not going to be able to do, be something that I do full time. I think <laughs> the people that are really into the classic and want to watch nothing but classics, they'd rather yeah. listen to someone that's about double my age. So I'm going to struggle with that front, but I, I think it will be more sort of focused towards that yeah. in, right. in, in time. But I'm not going to drop the modern stuff. You know, I've got the 902 Turbo S coming. Yeah. I love that. Um, I want a Cullinan as well. <laughs> Just be so rude, but there we go. Anyway, go on, sorry. Yeah, um, is there more dog and girlfriend content on the way? Do you know what? It does the views, but it's divisive views. Like, you know, I, I'll do a video saying well, that rubbish video I did recently saying we broke up. I mean, we didn't. It wasn't even a thing. She wasn't even happy that I put that out. Um, we didn't even break up. I just made it up. I know. But I thought, do you know what? I've made so many videos about kind of niche stuff about classic stuff and, you know, bits that I like, Test Ross from the first drive, and put a load of effort yeah. into a lot of those videos. And they didn't get the views that I wanted them to. And I don't think they got the views that they kind of. I think they deserve because I, I really love that side of things. So I was like, do you know what? Let's just do a social experiment. Let's just put out the biggest pile of poo I've done on the channel for two or three years and see what kind of views that gets. Yeah. And lo and behold, double, triple the views of any of the more considered stuff that I actually put an effort into. But I guess the, the people that watch the people that watch the girlfriend and dog stuff, um, that video particularly, that's important for me because I want people to buy into me, just not into the cars. So it's important to introduce that element. But also, uh, there were a lot of people that were fuming. A lot of people that have got, got there and are like, what is this nonsense? There's always going to be watch cars. It's like, yeah. well, you don't watch the, the proper stuff I'm making, so have some dribble. <laughs> yeah. um, but there's always going to be a mix. I'm going to keep those videos yeah. going, but I just thought it was interesting. Chris was two today, by the way. Yeah, I saw on Instagram. Happy yeah. birthday, Chris. Happy birthday, mate. It's not, he doesn't watch YouTube, but I'm just going to Another thing off. about getting the rescue animals as well. We've got two, yeah. we've got two rag dolls. Oh, two rag doll cats, beautiful rag doll They're cats. Love animals, things. yeah. We're in apartments, so we can't, we can't have cats because yeah. I just they end up squashed on the on the pavement, sort of ten floors down. But, um, yeah, at some point, cats, cats on yeah. the content soon come. Um, and finally, where do you see the channel in the next uh, five to ten years? Like all sort of cars. Like Hopefully, shut down because I've retired. That's, that's, that's like, ideal, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I, I, Realistically, mate, I have it? no idea. I have absolutely no idea. I don't know what the car collection is going to look like. I don't, I don't know, mate. So, um, yeah, yeah, wish me to, no plan whatsoever. That's pretty much it. Then, like, that? Thank you very much. Nice watch. I don't think I haven't spotted that. Good work, sir. It's his. It's one of my collection. Yeah. We're not going to say yeah. that. You're going to go, yeah, cheers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. cheap. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up so we can see that you like the video. Great content to come. And if you like our videos, then please look at the back catalogue that we've got below. We've got some great content on my 993S, the car that we owned before, and of course on the 458 Spider. Also wanted to give a quick shout out to Rob. Rob, you know who you are. Rob was a great help in helping us to orchestrate this interview with Tom. Very much appreciated, Rob. Thanks very much. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. If you're not subscribed, then please think about subscribing, and we'll see you in the next video.